up, y'all? This is Drunk in the Sun with Joe and Tom. Guess what? We're going to uh, get drunk and talk about everything under the sun. <laughs> Show about anything and anything under the sun. We didn't do that. All right. Let's do it. This episode yeah. is fire. Check us out every week on YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook, and Spotify. Oh, shit. I come at you every week. First of all, this is for entertainment. We're not educational. Yeah. We're not. If you're coming to get your education from us, you are clearly misguided. Exactly. But, but check us out. We're the show about anything and everything under the sun. We check us out. I show up. Like, what are you doing in there? He's like, I swear to God. Swear to me. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I don't think that's legit. I don't think it's legit. Either. <laughs> hey, what up, y'all, man? This is Drunk in the Sun with John. I said John. John. <laughs> John. No, it's Tom. Tom and Joe. God damn, how drunk am I? Hey guys! What's going on? Oh, that's just drinking. Ah, screaming, I deserve this. <laughs> what did he deserve? Fuck! Like and subscribe so you get the notifications when we do drop something. Probably pretty fucking lame. But anyways, check it out. Drinking the Sun, podcast about anything and everything under the sun. For whatever. I guess you can try something. So really, uh, the only thing I was thinking of, the only came into my head was, you know, Halloween. We talked about cryptids and shit, but we didn't talk about actual monsters like vampires, werewolves, mummies. What, shit. Halloween last year? Well, we did a Halloween show. I don't know if it was last year or not. Yeah, we did a Halloween show last year. It was last year. Okay, then. All right. I think we've done one every year since we've been Have on. we? I think so. Because every year we've done like a Christmas show, a Halloween show, Thanksgiving show. Okay. I don't know. All right. We, we've done a couple. A of... theme. It's a theme. If, we... it, 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 if it wasn't about Halloween, it was a Halloween theme. <laughs> yeah. But, but see, that's the thing. Anywho. And I was like, we hadn't talked about that yet. So I was like, what's my favorite monster like that? Like classic monster. Now you talk when you say classic monsters, you're talking about like the the Universal Studios monsters, basically like Dracula, Frankenstein, yeah, I guess M- more Creature or less. Black Lagoon, Werewolf, yeah, Mummy. Because most of those fall. Visible Man, in, yes, yes, most of those fall. Or in. just a, your favorite monster in general on movie screens. Really, it wasn't that. It was more what you said originally. Because I was thinking back of the books, actually, like you know Dracula, right, um, and. Uh, Bram Stoker. And, and, Taking notes at least. <laughs> and Frankenstein and shit like that. That's what I was thinking of. I was like, those are books. And they're like just classic. Not like cryptids. But movie movie monsters in general would work. So, do you have any favorites? Because out of the originals. What would out you of the originals? Originals. See, back in the day, I loved Dracula. I watched the fuck out of it. But it wasn't my favorite. My oh. favorite was Wolfman. Uh, I was always a, a werewolf fan. I loved the fucking werewolves. Now, as I got older, it kind of swayed a little bit more vampire-ish. Yeah. Because I like movies like Can't Breathe the Vampire. <laughs> fucking. Uh, I love I loved fucking. Uh, Blade? Bl- yeah. But uh, uh, from Dust of Dawn. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Fucking yeah. dope-ass vampire movie. Um, but I like the vampires that are like, they're va- like the eternal wretched. They can never sat- be satisfied. Like they have everything. You 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 live forever. You never die, but you never have anything. Yeah. Right. Basically. And that's what Interview with the Vampire kind of felt like to me. Yeah. You know. And and but, um, and, and same with like Dracula, because Dracula's always fucking. He's always got like Igor or yeah. whatever the fuck. Right. Yeah, he's got some crony. fucking guy. Yeah. He's always crony, but he can never come out in daylight. He can't, like it ain't that fucking that fucking uh Twilight bullshit. <laughs> I got no. sucked into that movie because I was like, oh, a vampire movie? What the fuck is this? Tormented? Fuck you! You can walk, you can do anything. Yeah, yeah, basically. You're not tormented shit! <laughs> like, you're eating fucking rabbits! Yeah. You know? And that, but, that, but that's why I like the, the one thing with the interview of vampire, like, when Brad Pitt's like, I'm not gonna kill him! I'm gonna fucking eat these rats. And like, oh, you fucking peasant. Fuck! <laughs> Right, yeah, but I, but it, but I, I liked. Uh, see, here I go. Again. No, no, you like here werewolf. I go. Sounding stupid again. <laughs> Anyways, but <laughs> werewolf, uh, Wolfman was like my favorite before vampire, and and I still I still care for it. Like 
American Warrior from London is one of my never, favorite fucking never, horror movies of all time. Shit. I need to watch it. I, it's on a number of streaming services. I'll it's have good. to watch it. Watch it. Um, but I, I still like the world because it's like fucking, it's like bestiality. It's like, it's not bestiality. <laughs> That's the wrong word. Wrong word. It's like, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Like you're animalistic. That's it. And Anim- you're just like, you can't control it. You know, yeah. It, it, yeah. It, 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 and most people who are werewolves don't want to be werewolves. Like this is going to suck. I'm going to kill everybody for 24 hours, but it'll be right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I, I don't know if I was ever like, I, I liked werewolves, but I think my first favorite has always been vampire for some reason. I just, I don't know. I, I liked it. They, Cause they look cool. Well, they look cool and they look. And they always like talk huge. like dashing. They, They're always they, dashing. You're like, <laughs> you don't need to wear that suit. So you're right. I don't need to wear this. But something like Jedi's. Yeah. <laughs> Nocturnal Jedi's. Yeah. <laughs> so more like Sith. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, that that was my first favorite. But I do like werewolves. But like, what do you think about Frankenstein or the concept of? Frankenstein? I think it's fascinating, and I think it's. Scary, but uh, because uh, I think it's fascinating. One, because it's like if a, if a guy can take a bunch of body parts and create a being, do humans have souls then? <laughs> well, <laughs> right? Because he's thinking, he's thinking like, oh, peasants come to burn me, ah! yeah. you know, because they they torch him at the end and whatever. Yeah, 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 yeah. But he's like the fucking, he's like the fucking, he's not the monster. It's the scientist that's the monster. Yeah, because he's defecating these corpses. He's taking whatever the fuck, and he's fucking making it into this thing that's against humanity and the laws of nature. <laughs> right? Is that like a direct quote from the movie? I don't remember, <laughs> but it it's like just it. one of those things. <laughs> but a lot of people would say that the the humans, not just the Doctor Frankenstein, is the monster because they because they want to accept him. Yeah, they're like oh, he's all right. He just tosses little kids in the river <laughs> to die. Because he does that at one point. She's like, ah! She's like, ah! She crying. Get rid of her. He's the worst parent ever. It's like, Wah! get off. Chuck that thing in the river. Chuck it in the river. Make sure make sure it sinks. Uh, uh. I've never read the book, though. I've read Dracula. I've never read the book, either. Have you read Dracula? Frankenstein's good. I have read Dracula. I have read Dracula. Uh, I read it fucking. It was eight, very anticlimactic. Might have been the joint. I know. I think I read it in the eighth grade, though. Yeah, but. Either it, the joint or it. <coughs> nonetheless. <laughs> same time frame, right? <laughs> no, I'm joking. But, but I, I remember a lot of, like, it, it like, painted a picture it did. of fucking, like, when he was coming in, the car- with, in his carriage through the mountains and fucking. Yeah. It was like. Jesus, I can see this. Yeah. It's crazy. It was very descriptive. So is there any ones that sta- other ones that stand out? The Creature from Black Lagoon. Creature from Black That's Lagoon. That's dope. I've never Where? watched it. What's it about? I've, I've seen it once. And it's That's just it? a monster. It's just a, just He's just a monster. monster. It's just a critter. People are going swimming, and he kills them! It's like Jaws, but human form. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but he's, he's like, yeah, like Swamp Thing. <laughs> basically, basically. Except he's not like a carrying <laughs> guy who is... Became Swamp Man. Yeah. Yeah, he just... Okay. I, I thought that was pretty cool. I haven't seen it. How about you? Like any particular monster in general? Yeah, but it's from the old school ones school. first. Yeah, I don't know. And then we'll go into the new school. Yeah. So from like world classics. <laughs> yeah, the, cl- the Universal classic. classic. I don't know. I, I really... I really like all of them, but I like probably Boris Karloff as Frankenstein the most. Just, the, <clears throat> just as as the actor in the movie in general, I think so. Yeah. Are you drawn to any of those in um, particular, though? Still probably, alone? probably still Frankenstein because I really liked the book too, and just this idea of like this guy didn't ask to be alive, and everybody's just being so fucking me all the time. <laughs> That's life. <laughs> exactly. I never asked to be born. It's so real. Like, this poor guy is just alive out of nowhere, and he's terrifying, and he just wants to be loved, and the world fucking sucks. That's why he became Herman Monster. <laughs> he's like, I embrace this humor. After years of therapy. <laughs> <It's> suffering. <laughs> 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 
Yeah, yeah, no, I get that. He reaches enlightenment and becomes Herman Munster. <laughs> That'd be awesome. Man. I haven't seen that new Munster movie. It's out now, though. Yeah, I, I watched half of it. And is it any good? It's not good. <laughs> it's not bad. <laughs> It, it, it's. It, I'm gonna tell it's you what. It's a movie. It's a movie. <laughs> but what I what I do say about it, the colors are beautiful. Mm-hmm. The way Rob Zombie shot it with this, in the cinematography, beautiful. But when you watch it, dude, I felt like I was watching a TV show, like legit. It probably was. And cool all movie. the actors, because I like the monsters. Yeah. I liked it more than the Adams Family. Oh, uh, Okay. And the fucking uh, all the actors were just like the TV series. Like it was dead on. Yeah, it was just it just felt like it felt like a long TV show. Like, like <laughs> oh, so it was it, it, I'll stay this welcome basically, kind of, <laughs> because, because it was like all this movement and the visuals were mm-hmm. beautiful and the acting was good. It was just like it's like come on. I, I've seen that in other movies that come from like TV shows. Yeah, like I even felt that way a little bit with The Simpsons. I was like, oh, this could have been one episode. Yeah. Type thing. It's entertaining. Yeah. You know, it's entertaining. So, we got the Universal Monsters out the way. Yeah, we did. <clears throat> you like Dracula. I like Wolfman and Dracula. Yeah. You like, like him. Frankenstein. <laughs> <laughs> Who likes Frankenstein? No, I get it. No, no, no because it is, it's a horrific, terrifying story of, yeah. of basically, like, all kinds of different shit. Yeah. Well, yeah. There's a but lot new movies. monsters. New. Like, all kinds <laughs> of new monsters out there. Like, right? we like talking about fucking... Michael Myers and shit. Yeah, all that, Freddy. All that. Um, I you, still like the Underworld series, which is vampires and yeah, werewolves. You just go back to your classics. I still like them. <laughs> I don't know why, but for me, more modern, especially even more modern, is I really like the Leatherface from Texas Chainsaw. Oh. That's my more my new modern like favorite, not the original. Because I didn't see the original first. I saw like the 2000 whatever remake. Oh. It was like 2005, five, six, something. I don't know. Early. I thought it was good. Yes, I was in the movies and I watched it. Because I'd never seen anything like that before at the theater. And it's terrifying. Like, and I watched it and I was like, this is fucking cool. And then I watched the original. And I gotta say, I like the, the, the remake better. <laughs> it's because it wasn't... It was it's the a first different era. type of movie. I yes. Think. It's probably yes. a different type of movie. It's a different era. And there's more nostalgia for me. Because it was my, my baby, my first one type thing. I see that happening to me anyways. But anyways. So what ones do you like at least? Like what monster movies nowadays? Do you or like? modern novel. Because I know you don't know a lot of, or watch a, I don't know. Anyways, you don't watch continue. a lot of horror movies? No, she does. I watch really... a shiller. <laughs> Have you guys watched New Hellraiser? No. Not yet. I'm very hype about it. I watch it. Uh... And the old hell, do you like the old Hellraiser? Mm-hmm. That's a monster. That's a new age monster. Yeah, like fucking. And the older Hellraiser is dope. I've yeah. seen. I've seen a little. This bit one's of completely it. different. Oh, is it? But it's not bad. Okay. Not bad at all. I liked it. I thought it was dope. I didn't think it was bad. Mm-hmm. You know, it's pretty dope. Fucking. Anyways, go ahead. <laughs> this is what Tom does. <laughs> he asks you a question and he answers it for you. <laughs> what I do. I that's, why, that's why when I watch shows all the time, I'm like, fuck this guy! Like, God damn, <laughs> shut up! <laughs> Trying to. I don't, I don't know if I... I'm really into, like, modern cult stuff. Like, Midsummer. if you... Midsummer. Is that the one? No, I haven't, I haven't seen it, no. It... Uh, it, it's like a it's a cult. It's like cult stuff. So Did they like you lure would... some, like a bunch of kids to some to their yes. deaths? Yes, yes, basically. Yes. And then they absorb some that survive, basically. Yeah. Right. So basically, what she's saying they're is they're after one and they kill everybody. Never else. go camping with her. Yeah. <laughs> yes. It was more of a retreat <laughs> to another yeah. country. But, but if you can, if you would consider cults a monster. Then I would have to go with well, any it's a horror. sort of like it's horror, yeah, it's cult horror. or like coven or anything Some like witches. that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you get the, like the craft. You ever yeah. seen the craft? Yes, I've seen. The craft. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's an older movie. <laughs> or the Omen. Right. I haven't seen Omen. I've seen the craft though. I've seen the craft. The original Omen is so much better. Than so you're the back at one. Oh, there's a remake. Yeah. I haven't seen the remake. I've seen the old one. But I haven't seen the old one. The since, old like, one I was is like... Back in the day. 
Yeah, I, I don't think I've ever seen the old one. It's about Damien. The He's the fucking like, when Antichrist. Did it come out? He's the Antichrist. It's got great like the 80s? In it. I think oh, the 80s, okay. 70s, 80s, some shit like that. I haven't seen that. It. We will have to see if we can no, stream I've, it somewhere no, because I've seen it's the, amazing. The Exorcist. Oh, that's a good one. Have, oh, so you've seen it. Well, yeah, I've seen it. <laughs> fucking Exorcist, dude. <laughs> It was not because great. I'm a horror fan, because I'm a film fan. <laughs> no, I just saw Fucking it for the guy. first time not that long ago. Like only a couple years ago. <laughs> Is the first time you saw it when we watched it? <clears throat> no. Okay. I think I watched it like briefly before then, like not very. See, far. Jaws is another monster that I like. Yes, that movie mm, is Jaws terrifying. Counts. But it is very well done. Very, very well done. I mean, you got fucking Steve Spielberg. It's disturbing, and it's that's why I hate the water. That movie right there is why I don't like the ocean. Yeah, is that why you don't like the beach? <laughs> no. I hated the beach for different reasons. It sucked. In fact, I watched. I, I walked under sharks like Jaws. <laughs> I got good footage of them, so I'm like, "This is cool." Oh shit! It's like the movie, Ma. I I would shit my pants. Well, maybe not. Dude, it's dope but, as fuck. No, no, no. I I would be okay with that. I'd be okay with that. But like in real life, I showed you the footage, didn't I? Yeah. Dope. Yeah, yeah it's great. You know, we're talking about monsters. Yeah, but we're gonna cut a lot of this but, shit out. Right? <laughs> but Jaws is a monster. Jaws is a monster. What about Jeepers Creepers? Do you Ooh, like that monster? Yes. Jeepers. Creepers. At least doesn't like the movie. You don't like the movie? I don't, I don't know. I it was wasn't right. I like the first one. I watched the first one. That's the only one I watched. The I second one's super man. into Jeepers Creepers. But now like Candyman. Ooh. Very, Don't very say his name. <laughs> oh, that's why. You like Candyman? <laughs> like Tony I was, I was actually watching a movie today that he's he's a cameo. I mean, I, he's a small part. Is before Candyman. I was watching Colors. Uh, fucking the gang movie yeah. and he's the fucking dad like in the fucking uh, he, there's a scene where he's just fucking cussing people out <laughs> cussing cops out I'm like it's Candyman <laughs> I didn't realize it till today I'm like just Candyman he's in colors i never seen that but I only just saw Candyman the original not that long ago it's badass now had you seen the remake no I'm not I've oh, okay. still I have not seen, not seen it. it's not a remake though it's a sequel uh, yeah. Yeah. because it, it like it like it. takes off yeah well, yeah he was just, I knew he was still the guy and I looked at the cast and, and uh, uh, was that chicken dude? yeah uh, what's her name uh, Ma- uh, Masden uh, Marsden uh, what's her name John Marsden no but she, she, she's <laughs> no but her, her last name is like Marsden or Masden yeah. Madsen one of the two I can't remember her fucking name. Blonde yeah. chick. Yeah, the one that turns into Candyman in, basically at the end. Yeah, she was she was in Jim Carrey's thirteen number thirteen. She was in that movie. That movie was weird. I never saw that. It was weird. See, when you said number it was thirteen, really weird. I was trying to it's correlate weird. with the time frame of Candyman. I was like, what the fuck was that? No, it, like, it came 13. out later. <laughs> yeah, it came out way later. Way later. Yeah, Candyman's scary, dude. Fucking uh, but have you seen Nope yet? No. There's a monster in there that scares the fuck out of me. <laughs> yeah. There's a monster in that one. Yeah. Um, I can't believe I've not watched that yet, knowing that it's aliens. Oh, it's dope. It's really... Nope is dope. <laughs> I'm sure it is. I've seen some of the other movies that Oh, now, do the Jordan aliens Field? from Science Count as a monster? As what? Yeah. Fuck, yes. yes. Aliens? Aliens signs? from Signs. Yes. Movie. All from Signs? That movie scared the shit out of me. I didn't sleep for like three weeks. That's a fantastic movie. Every time <laughs> yeah. I A lot of people close, shit on it. I love that movie. I, I love that fucking movie. I would asleep and I would like hear like the click sound and shit and I would just wake up. Yeah. Yeah. I could, I could not sleep for weeks. <laughs> I was gonna be terrified. Like... <laughs> I'm like, I'm in the shadows. <laughs> Wake up and punch you in the face. She's like, got water. <laughs> <laughs> but she, I mean, he's had some good movies, though, that were like that. Because I even like Signs. So that was a good kind Science of... Signs is dope. Yeah. Um, that's one of my favorite M.I. Shyamalan movies, yeah, honestly. Yeah, Signs. I like it a lot. Because yeah. I like it so much because it's scary as fuck without giving you, like... The, the aliens like you yeah, see like the you aliens like three the times yeah. yeah you see like a hand here and there yeah, yeah. and it's just like it's just it, yeah it, it's so fucking creepy and scary yeah. the, like the reveal that's how the first alien movie is like yeah when they you know finally yeah, yeah. show you the alien on the television and like joaquin phoenix's reaction like anytime i talk to anybody about that movie that's like their favorite part just because of how like 
how just real that whole fucking thing was and like how terrified he looked well not only i mean not only that i mean mel gibson was the shit in that movie yeah and fucking yeah. uh that was back when he was all together i mean yeah, i, I love mel gibson I do don't get me wrong yeah, i do too. the guy has one bad night <laughs> Guys, one bad night. There is no life because he's got a fucking shit ton of movies I like that he's directed. That he's fucking in yeah. everything. I, I I don't give a fuck. He did I'll love him. Anyways, that, movie. that movie is the shit. Uh, yeah, and it's Macaulay one. Culkin's brother in it. Yeah, the younger kid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The asthma kid. Yeah. He said, like, "We can put these helmets on. <laughs> Their hats. Yeah. Fucking yeah. Calls them. What was the aluminum foil? You think that works? Yeah, it's tin foil. Yeah, tin foil. but it was based like one of the sixties. This one was base, wasn't it? I don't know when it was. It was no, like 50, I think it was, it was supposed it, to be modern. I don't think it was. I think it was supposed to be like based on like fifties or sixties, because like they, they were fucking. Because back in the no, day, think about the models of the cars, though. I don't. I don't know. It's been a minute since I've seen the. Yeah, car. like I he's driving a modern like. Is he? Yeah, like an SUV. Yeah. Yeah, it's like right. an SUV. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're right, Lise. <laughs> but I don't know. It might be a little dated, but not not very much. No, I think she's right. Honestly, I think she's right because they're watching the fucking TV and shit. Yeah. I think she's right. Yeah. Honestly, because yeah, now I think box, about it, I think she's TVs. right. Huh? They're box, they're box TVs. TVs, but yeah, but still we had box TVs modern. back in the day. <laughs> I would say like eighties. Yeah, I think I think she's right. At the earliest, that's, I mean, <laughs> but, it's, but it's a dope ass movie. It is a great scary movie. One of my well, we've talked about Pitch it. Black. That oh, movie shit. with the mo- <laughs> those monsters scare the fuck out of me. Ah. Ah. Yeah, it's but that too. would be a terrifying circumstance, just like Thirty Days of Night, basically. Oh yeah, with the vampires. Cyrus loves that movie. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's, that's like a his sweet movie. Shit. Yeah, I mean it's a freaking graphic novel though too. Before it was a movie. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I think I mean, that one's good because the it almost makes you feel claustrophobic because you're in this town in the middle of fucking nowhere. And it's dark. And you can't do, you can't go anywhere. Because yeah, it's fucking slow. yeah. You're like, you're stuck there, and it's for dark. thirty days. Yeah, that's fucking. <laughs> and then everybody's a vampire. Dead. But that's a very creative, like. No, it's dope. Like if I, if I was a vampire, <laughs> yeah. that's where I'd go. I'm like, hey guys, we can't feel the cold. Because vampires ain't feeling that shit. Yeah. They're already dead. Yeah. Their skin is cold. They don't give a fuck about <laughs> snow. They're like. <laughs> Like scurrying through. Yeah, I mean, it's right. It's a great concept. It's very dope. Oh man, monster. Uh, um, I thought Twenty Eight Days Later was really good too. Oh like yeah, the, the zombie zombies. Flick. Yeah, yeah. I, that's I, one of the better I, zombie flicks. Well, see, I've only seen it a little bit. It's I'm better not, than the sequel. The sequel kind of sucks. I'm not super great about fast zombies. Mm-mm. I thought that they were fast. Yeah, they were yeah, fast in that fast, one. They like chased Yeah, they were fast in that one. I yeah, I'm, like I'm, I'm thinking of something else. I, I don't like that about my zombie. <laughs> you want the easy zombie where you just like, oh, watch out. Arr! Hey, we can sit here for 30 minutes and he'll get to us in 20. We're good. <laughs> but I think it's more scary if they're like, fuck, he's as fast as fucking insane bolt guy. <laughs> Go! Run! Can they climb trees? Let's hope not. Probably. If they can yeah. climb, they can climb. <laughs> That's more scarier, though, dude. It is more scary, but it's not believable. I mean, the, I think t- they would have the same abilities that they had in life. Like, I don't think oh. they, they I don't think as a dead person you would be you able have to supernatural run any powers. Faster. Yeah. But what if it was something else giving you life on the other it, side? Well, it's it like Satan depend. going, feed, feed. <laughs> <laughs> it would depend on what the cause of the zombie virus was, I think. Oh. Because if it was like an organic. Just your virus. brain, you die, but your brain still keeps going. Yeah, like if it was a cordyceps right. fungus, that makes sense. And it hijacked your brain, you wouldn't be able to really go any faster. You'd still be you normal. Would be slower. Yeah. It'd be as fa- so. So, jo- they so be- I have to worry about Joe's fucking corpse at all. <laughs> no, yeah, I'm gravy. Yeah. No, not at all. He's not even getting up. All the MMA <laughs> fighters, all the MMA fighters, like, <laughs> like yeah, fucking spinning your on your head, zombies. fucking you up, like shit. <laughs> he was on fire. <laughs> Judo zombies. Yeah. Joe, Joe zombies yeah. over here like. Joe zombies like, I don't want to, I don't want to do anything. <laughs> Can it come to me? <laughs> Basically. You'd be a shitty zombie. So would I though. Dude, if I, if I was a zombie, I'd be like, I'm 
did. <laughs> I would just start. And I'd be like, fuck this. Because, no, like, no. But I'm not making an effort. But the zombies from I Am Legend <coughs> have been injected with something. Now, to, see, then I think that would be different. Because they're like, Captain America zombie. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that would suck, dude. Yeah. Yeah. They'd be all the, uh, pew, pew, pew. <laughs> Well, they were shooting. They were just fast and strong and could do shit. Yeah. Haven't you seen that movie? I have seen okay. it. Okay, I'm just making sure. It's been a minute ago, though. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty good, though. But as far as zombies go. But, yeah. Is there any, like, more modern wolf? wolf Werewolves? Yeah. They did uh, Benicio Del did Toro Twilight. as Wolfman. Oh, yeah, they did. Yeah, yeah. But, that, but that was a remake of the original. I yeah. know, right? but I did yeah. like that one. I, I haven't but they seen had, like, the howling and shit it. back in the day. They had the howling. Yeah. You had, uh... They had a the bu- werewolf in London. Werewolf in London. I think yeah. Ginger Snaps is from the 2000s. Mm, I think With right. Christina Ricci? No, that's Cursed. Um, oh! It had um, Catherine Isabel in it. And it's... Ginger Snaps. I think I've seen that, though. I think I know what you're talking about. Yeah, it's a... Uh, she turns into a werewolf and she gets her period. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds about right. <laughs> it turned into a monster. Yeah. I think we all can relate. It's that same time of the month. What is she? It's all right. She's just a monster this time. For like twenty hours. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But man, has there? I don't. I don't I think there's been anything since that. Yeah. Oh uh, well, except I mean, for Underworld. Uh, Underworld. Underworld. Well, but that was yeah. Before. Marvel's Werewolf by Night. Is, yeah. Is, yeah. That I thought was great. It was amazing. It was pretty good. Was I pretty, thought it was amazing. It was weird as shit to me. I was like, what in the fuck is that? That man thing in it? I was like, man thing, yes! I hope they do more of these. Like, oh, I want to see more of that I'm sure. Shit. I'm sure they will. Turn on the sun. The show about anything and everything under the sun? <laughs> I guess. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing right now. I, I gave up. Felix is like, fuck this guy. Thanks for tuning in, Drunk of the Sun. This is Joe and Tom. Thanks for watching. A thanks to everybody. Like and subscribe. Thank you all for subscribing and liking. From Drunk of the Sun, the podcast about everything and anything under the sun. So check us out on YouTube, Facebook, Spotify, and Instagram. We're posting new shit every week. See ya.